Hello, my name is Mordred Viking, and I'd like to welcome you to episode 38 of this Let's Play Project Zomboid. In the last episode, we continued doing some scavenging, and we did ultimately find some stuff, but not the stuff we were actually looking for. Why are you not shutting? Come on, shut the door. Thank you. Um, we also gained... Uh, oh, wait, that was right at the end of the episode. Uh, what else did we do? We scavenged most of the rest of the little suburb that's up there. And we brought our goods back, which I have now sorted. Much of it actually went into the second house, the next door one, not that one. Uh, between episodes, I did indeed sort out the kit, as I said that I would. I also spent a little bit of time doing a bit of foraging, just to make sure we kept our food stocks high. Uh, we rested, and we are good to go again. It is once again midnight, pretty much. But I think we're okay to go. So we're going to have to find a new neighbourhood to loot. I think we have pretty much exhausted the suburbs that were up there. So we need to find some new areas. The other thing that happened, of course, is we got enough experience. Oh, don't tell me I'm getting tired already. Right, I spent the time up till now looting. Sorry, foraging, not looting. Which is why I'm probably getting a bit tired, but I think we'll be fine. Um, so yes, we got enough experience to actually get another skill point, but I'm going to save that one, I think, for when we get our carpentry. And the objective right now is, of course, to get more carpentry skill. This house has not been... Ooh, there's a couple. Okay. Let's see what we got. Oh, come on, climb through. Thank you. Alright, doors are all open. Including that door, which <laughs> usually means I've actually looted this place. It rather looks that way, doesn't it? I just didn't have the back door open. Is that going to be the case for all of these? I hope not. Let's try this one. Alright, so this one, the front door is shut. So I'm hoping that was just a, a one-off. Bowl. Oh, I did not mean to put that in there. You were supposed to go in there. Didn't realise I had that junk with me still, so I'll put that away. Sardines, carrot seeds, matches, sugar, water bottle, chocolate, popcorn, chocolate, garbage bag. I think it is only garbage bags that you need, not plastic bags. Some more water bottles, ketchup. Everything else though is rotten, unsurprisingly. And nothing on the shelf. Okie dokie. Now we know that there are zombies like right out there, so we do need to be a little bit careful here. And not attract them. That's not the books that we wanted. We're still gonna nick them all though. Still not. Ah! Give me the stuff I need! Is this a two story? This was a two story. There might be some zombies upstairs, I'm not sure. I'm just going to turn the sound on a little bit louder so I can actually hear things. Yeah, we'll take the ammunition, sure, of course. Alright, let's take a look upstairs, shall we? Ooh, another bookcase. Getting hungry. There's lots of bookcases here, but not the books that we need. Arr. I'm getting hungry. Well, we can have a bite to eat a bit later. Nothing in there. Whoa, jeez. Mm. 
I even came in here. Where on earth did you come from? Didn't manage to hit us, but... Whoa. Then, of course, I was hitting the door instead of... Sorry, I was hitting her instead of the door so it wouldn't open. Whew! <laughs> that was a bit unexpected. Right, now in the zombies, so we're just going to very quietly... Open the door. I'm going to back off and come out of here. Leaving the doors open so we can say, we have been here. Alright, next house. It is definitely getting a bit lighter now, which is good. A couple of zombies down there, but they don't seem to have really noticed us. Okay, so there is a guy in there, but I'm a little bit afraid that if I start beating on him, then this lot are going to come over. So I'm going to shut that window. Here you are there. Four? I think I can do four. Come on then. As long as we stay away from those ones. Come on. Come on. There you go. Hello. Bam! Next. Let's do a quick look around. Come on. There you go. Welcome to the party. Come on, splat. Thank you. Stomp and shove. Sticking stomp and smash. I was like, that's not right. <laughs> Sit down. Alright, what do we get? Probably nothing. Yeah, nothing. But we should now have access to that house at least, maybe even that one. Let's try this one first. Come in the side window here. Alright, I can hear zombies inside. Hello. <gasps> we'll lead you outside and we'll fight you out here where it's a little bit safer. Further away from them. And you're gonna come as well. Marvellous. More to the party. I'm over here. Ooh. Come on. Ah, you idiot. Oh, I can hear several of you in there. Right. I can hear so many zombies banging on things here. Probably in there. Stomp, shove, stomp, shove, stomp, 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 stomp. Come on, just fall down, thank you. I did see some zombies out there, but they don't seem to have actually noticed us. Which is good. Alright, there was nothing in there, nothing in the bathroom, okay. Check these other rooms real quick. Nothing there. And one guy here. Hopefully no one behind me. Alright. 
don't like that room, it's really badly laid out. You have a pen. I'll take your pen. Nothing on the shelves. More zombies. Where? I'm hearing you, but I'm not seeing you. I was like, that's sounding really close now. Okay. Three. Four, five. Six. Alright, so we seem to have attracted a bit of attention. We're going to back these guys up, just to separate them from their comrades over there who don't seem to have actually noticed us yet. Right, if it's just four of them, we can take that. It's no problem. Whoa, it is a problem if we miss the swings there. Too many. do here is we're going to take this seriously. We're going to eat some pills to get our panic down and we'll see what we can do about these jokers. So our baseball bat is not the strongest and if it breaks I'm not sure we actually have a backup with us anymore. Uh, let's be a bit careful about this, eh? This is probably more than I should be fighting. Discretion is the better part of valor. Let's pull them away and then just kind of detour around. So we're going to pull you this way. We're going to sneak through this forest over here. Hopefully not attracting them at the same time. That at least is the plan. All right, let's see what we can do. Okay. That has actually worked pretty well. So far. Perfect. Don't make a burglar of me yet. Oh, don't be sprinting. That makes noise, and noise is bad. I still need to get into that thing over there. Alright, let's grab something to eat. Real quick. Those guys haven't come back yet. Doesn't look like it though. Stomping shelf time. I saw you. Cheeky. Hello. Welcome to the party. Sit down. No, nope. that way. Thank you. Much obliged. Alright, so we're doing quite a lot of damage to the zombie numbers in this area, I think. We're doing a number on their numbers. Yeah, that wasn't funny. Come on in. Come on. Sorry about that, getting a bit of a scratchy throat. Stomp and shove time. Still no one coming. Oh, I saw another pen. I want. 
Oops. There you go. Now, can I please finish looting this place? Rolling pin. Nick of time. Some more bowls. Sure. Aluminium. Not sure what that would be for. Right, I think I can probably stop stealing all the bowls. Nothing else in the fridge. Oh, beef jerky, yeah, we want that, sure. Mustard, sure, why not? Alright, is there no bookcase in this place? Rather looks like that is the case. That there is not a case. Okay. I have a feeling, yeah, that was the small group that was here that we have now just killed. So, I'm going to guess it's just going to be that one guy that's left in here. Hello. Where are you? I have a feeling there is another guy, so I need to be careful. There's one in here, wasn't there? Apparently not anymore. Alright. And bathroom. No. Duct tape. Yes, we want that. Ooh. Ah. Uh, yes. We. Oops. We want that for sure. How to use generators? Yes. Abso. Frickin' lootly. Actually, you know what? I'm so happy about that. I'm going to read it right now. How to use a generator? Because that means I can now hook up the generator, and we got refrigeration again. Now I just need to find a, a generator. <laughs> I think we might actually have one at the um, safe house. I think. Alright, so there is a group over there, but they're still a ways away. I think we're okay. We'll loot this house. Nice little neighbourhood here. So we found one of the uh, books that we badly wanted. We still need to find the others though. Oops. We are rather hungry. Now another thing I noticed, which I think was between episodes, is our weight here is now very underweight. We are really losing it rather rapidly. Which means we need to start eating a bit better. Though we have not had many opportunities to do so. Alright, just doing the... Very Quick zombie search here. For that reason. <laughs> Come on. And fall over. Oh, stop. There we are. Just keeping an eye around me. Alright, might look good. Let's kill you. Oops. Didn't think that was going to stomp you. See, the angles are sometimes a bit weird. Right, both of you are down. Oh, we'll have a key. Thank you. Much obliged. Is that it? That was it. Alright, nothing in there. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. Ooh, bookcase. But you don't have the books that I want. Why not? Popcorn, whiskey. I'm going to start leaving bowls and stuff now, I think. Uh, I'll take that. We'll take, whoops. All of those. Alright. In fact, all the uncooked um, microwave meals. We can now hook up a microwave to a generator. And we'll have access to that. No, I didn't take the rice. My mistake. Probably going to overburden me. Yeah, I thought so. Grab you two. You go in there. Just carry you straight. I do think that this is going to be pretty much everything from here. Mayonnaise has gone off. Um, from this little neighbourhood. So it's time for us to run back and dump this gear. Sleeping tablets. I'll take those. Nothing else. Right. Definitely no other bookshelves and things here. Does not look like that is the case. Ooh, what's that? Nothing. Okay. 
Now, is this house done? I think that's just a construction site, so there won't be anything there of interest, as far as I'm aware. No, I don't think so. Oh, storage. Is this another storage place? Yeah, it must be. It's just a part time I haven't been to. I've not set up my uh, laptop, so. Oh, hello. Um, I don't have the map open in front of me at the moment. Oh, that's just a straight kill. No, that was not a straight kill. That is a lot of zombies over there. So, we're going to go this way. What's this? Church? Yeah, okay, I know where we are. Whoa, hello. Hi. Right, I think it's time for us just to head home. Uh, zombies are kind of congregating in this area again. Must have realised that something alive was in the area. So I think we'll just return this stuff or we're exhausted, so we are going to need to sleep. I believe this is the suburb that we've picked clean. Yes, it is. These are the two houses, and just behind these two houses is our place. Did not expect to be exhausted already, though. Wow. So I think we will sleep first, and then we'll sort out the inventory. Just checking around, nothing around us. Good. Nothing. Oh. Looks good here. All right. Sweet home. We'll eat something the next day. Also known as tomorrow. Sleep. That's fine. Losing even more weight. Crikey. We're going to have to start cooking up something better at some point. I was really kind of hoping that we'd make it to our other place, get it all fortified nicely, and then we can break out the tins and basically just <laughs> uh, basically just uh, eat those. Sorry, breaking out the tins is British slang for breaking out the cans of beer and drink those and just survival for that, which I'd be also okay with. Except I don't know how many uh, six packs we've actually found in this playthrough so far. Um, medicines? Did I not? Yes, I did find one medicine thing. I think pretty much everything else will go next door. Except I do have one book I wish to leave here. I'm sure you can guess which. Because even though we have read it, if this character dies and we decide to continue in this world in a future playthrough, they will not have read it. So, I'm going to pinch a notebook. One of you for that. There we go. Oh, and I should also double check the books that I have found. Versus, what do we have there? Advanced cooking. Do we have an advanced cooking? Advanced cooking. Yes, we do. Advanced trapping? We don't, actually. Uh, cooking for beginners? Yeah. Uh, books? Just regular? Well, we don't have the space for it, so that's irrelevant. Right, let's go next door and dump most of this stuff. I'm very much looking forward to the point when we can actually start making crates, <laughs> which will require more carpentry. It really seems like carpentry is just the thing that stops us. Uh, ammunition I'll keep. That can go. All of this food can go in there. Bowls will keep. Sparklers can go. Duct tape I'll keep. Matches can go. Piece of paper, sleeping tablets I'll keep, because we actually have a fairly decent storage spot for medicines. We haven't used up too much space there. Likewise, water. How's the old baseball bat doing? 
We could probably use that duct tape on this baseball bat. Right, you know what? I'm going to do that. Primary, and we can chuck these books in there. Electronics magazine, empty notebooks, journal, all of this stuff, except for the uh, rolling pin I'm going to keep for now, unless I repair the baseball bat. Oh, you've actually equipped it. Great. That was not my intention. Repair to duct tape. Ah, we have already repaired this, apparently. Oh no, it's just not as effective. Wood glue is better on baseball bats. And we need more carpentry as well, so screw that. Uh, yes, we definitely want to carry the rolling pin then. Grip both hands. This is pretty much full. This one, however, is not. So, pens, magazine, journal, all of that stuff in there. Anything from here? Yes. Everything else I think can go in the other house. Thankfully there is a lot of space in here. We've not had a helicopter for a really long time. After having two helicopters in a row on our way to the uh, water place, we've not had one since. How often they're supposed to come around? We've been going for over a month, a month and a half. I guess they're going to be like once a month or something. I kind of like it while I'm, you know, at home. Actually, no, because then all the uh, zombies come here, and then we'd be like, ah, and they'd be like, Rrr. and we'd be like, nah, and they'd be like, Rrr. just like that. that. That was a perfectly accurate rendition of how it would be. Water bottles, bowls, medicines, sleeping tablets, and the ammunition we can put in our. Uh, bedside table. And then I think we'll grab a bite to eat and we'll head off again. So we'll just put the ammunition in here. Three, two, one, zero. And we're going to carry the rolling pin in case we need it. And the uh, seeds which we will definitely be carrying with us to the other house, can go in here. Marvellous! Right. Uh, actually, I'm going to end this episode right there. I think this is a pretty good stopping point. Uh, actually, I should put duct tape and the matches away. Um, so, thank you very much for watching. Please do like and subscribe if you are enjoying this series. If you have any tips or advice, then please do leave a comment. Just be aware that I am pre-recording stuff at the moment, so if I'm not able to get back to you, like, implement what you're suggesting immediately, then please do bear with me on that. Uh, otherwise, I'm just very much looking forward to, you know, engage with you guys in the comment section. If you are enjoying this series, then please do throw me a like and a subscribe. Both of them are very much appreciated. And I'll catch you next time. Goodbye.